Hello and welcome back to Tormented Souls. I hope you're all doing well. And, uh, having a good day and good week. So I still got to do this. Um, apparently, you start it off on here. So. It's the four leaf clover. There we go. <coughs> I'm fucking out. Necklace with a sun design. Okay. But yeah, I uh, hope you're all uh, looking after yourselves and everything. And uh, we are. Oh, hello, this is open back up now. And we're uh, playing some more Tormented Souls. Necklace with a moon design. Sun and the moon. I think I know where this goes, actually. <clears throat> um, we need to try and find the children's bedroom. I can't quite remember where that is, though. I hope you're all enjoying the uploads lately. If there's any other sort of games you'd like me to play, then just leave a comment down below. I'm always up for playing something new. Alright, children's bedroom. Public restroom, laundry, shower room, that's a student note. Um... Alright. Seems like you can get rid of this ghost or whatever it is by just backing out of the uh, room and coming back in again. Yeah, it's been a few days since I played this, so... <clears throat> oh, my bloody girl. Lord, Lord, Lord. I think the children's bedroom is here. Yeah. Yeah, because of this here. Sundial. Ooh, hello, hello, hello. Trophy earned. What is this? I know this song. I know it. It's the song my sister and I used to listen to when we were children. My sister. My sister Anna. I remember. I am Emma. 
The girl who fell from the bridge 14 years ago. All this time, I've kept the traumatic memories hidden inside my head. But this song has set them free. Anna, you have been alone in the dark this whole time. I don't know if you are still there, but I promise I will do everything in my power to find you. It's time to find out what's behind the vault door in the sewers. I'm guessing that's our next location then. So that means that the girl in the past in the cage is our sister. A metal fishing hook with a sharp point. The fuck do I use that for? And I and I listen to this while playing together in this room. Mm, interesting. Oh, fuck. So, back down into the bloody sewers we go. Lovely. What the fuck? Where's the body gone? The dentist room is written on the label. Let's go back and check this out, see what this is in a minute. Boom, boom. The meeting room. Uh, right. Check a chapel. What the fuck? So how far back in the past is this then? X-ray images help. Well, like I said, I hope you're enjoying this uh, let's play. <clears throat> This body appears to have been operated on multiple times. It doesn't even look human anymore. Who is doing this? Definitely going to try getting the platinum on this game, I think. Oh, I know where we are. Oh shit! What? Hang on a minute. No fucking way, we're the one who cut our own eye out. Oh. My right eye, I can't believe I did that to myself. 
If you did this to her, doesn't that mean that another version of us has just done it to us? If that makes sense. Okay. William Wildberger's diary. Late last night, someone broke into the mansion, a young and reckless woman. I do not know what brought her here, nor do I care. I hit her over the head with a lead pipe, which I admit was unwise. Had I hit her much harder, she would not have survived, and a potential test subject would have been wasted. She is now unconscious with assisted ventilation. Once she has stabilised, I will inject her with Maria's blood. I am close to finding the cure. Wait for me, Maria, just a little longer. Okay. Guessing that's all that's left to do in here then. Back down the sewers we go. After we get rid of this fucking thing. One thing I bloody hate about this place, I can't fucking find out where I'm going. Is it down this way? Yeah, have done this way, wouldn't it? Well, last time we used this, though, I couldn't get in. Hang on a minute. Should be able to get in though. Why you would want to open this door anyway, I do not know. It's the priest. How does he know how to do that?
Grandfather Noah? Now I remember you. Oh God, you have your memories back. Then you remember that your stupid mother stopped me from sacrificing you and your sister. What? A sacrifice that could have brought back our savior. Well, God took care of her. He made her pay for her sins. This is all your fault. Did you kill my father too? The radiation that comes from the sacred placenta is extremely harmful to us impure and worthless beings. For years, Bertram and his son William after him tried to find a cure for the effects of radiation. Today, William succeeded. With this accomplished, I have no use for him anymore. May God welcome him into his realm. You will pay for this, Noah. What have you done to my sister? Where is she? Your sister is just another tool for me to awaken our savior. Follow me if you want your answers. What the fuck? I thought you was cool, hey, priest. Wait, where do you think you're going? Come here, priest. I'm gonna put a fucking nail in you. A suit to keep out radiation. I can feel someone staring at me from inside. Bert Bertrand Wildberger's diary. Maria has escaped with the girls. I will stay at the temple blocking the door from the inside to keep the cult members locked in for as long as possible. Seven billets will not protect me for long, but I will try to make each one count. William, I do not ask you to forgive me. I do not deserve it. But if one of these letters makes it to you, I want you to know that I am sorry from the bottom of my rotten soul. I am sorry for everything. Interesting. And it's gonna be fucking pitch black in here, I can already see it. <laughs> Holy fuck man, I can't see anything. Something can be placed here. Padlock? Uh, oh, okay, that I do not get. To line them up, that's what I'm guessing. Don't tell me you gotta line them up properly because that's gonna be an absolute prick. Okay, never mind. Alright, fair enough. terrors I'll face below, but if Anna is there, I will find her, no matter what.
I don't like the dark. Bunker 1A. Pollock set member's diary. It has been six months since that damn Bertram closed the vault from the inside. I hardly recognize myself anymore. We should have been protected from radiation. We were supposed to be the chosen ones. What does it mean? Are we not worthy? Our suits have served only to delay the blood poisoning process. Nothing more. Bertram promised us a cure, but at this point I don't think there is any way, any hope for me. Oh fuck! I don't like this area. I don't like it at all. Oh, safe thing. Bunker 1, 2B. Yeah, I doubt we had some fucking power in it. What the fuck is all this? Oh, it looks like I can't do that. Clip and nails. Maintenance crew. There we go. Yesterday I tried pumping gas into a canister, but it didn't matter how much I spun the handle, not a drop of gas came out, even though it was full. I told the boss what had happened and he looked extremely disappointed. He grabbed three small handles, said wait here, and then left. He came back 15 minutes later with a full canister of gas. So it looks like we need the uh, handles then, I'm guessing. What does that look... Oh fuck. Okay, new enemy type. Bunker 2C. Screw on metal cap. You used to. Oh, right, okay, I know what that's for then. remember everything. I fell into the river from the bridge all these years ago. Noah is keeping my sister Anna in the underground bunker. He is the one who has engineered all of this. He has had my sister in captivity all this time. I won't let this end now. Better way save it there, just in case. Oh, nice.
We've done it. After many failed attempts with previous test subjects, we were able to bring two healthy twin girls into the world. I do not know if we will be able to cap be capable of repeating this feat, but this is progress. We will wait until the subject turns 10 years old for the sacrifice, for now these results have brought peace to our members. Alright, let's go up a minute. Never mind, I'll go fuck myself. Let's go down. I did reload my, um... I don't like the noises, man. Bunker 3B. Holy shit, man, I can't see anything in this place. Oh fuck! Oh shit! Stop. rather not be bloody wasting never mind I will waste it that's the way I came in it is it? Shit. The day of the sacrifice has come. Nowhere has taken the girls to the temple. I must finish getting ready to officiate the ritual. Has this suit always felt so heavy over my shoulders? I need a drink. <laughs> this place is a fucking maze, man. Oh, kiss me. They actually seem a little bit weaker than they were before. Prison. Oh my god. Shotgun shells. Bunker free C. No, I want to go back in it. This place is going to confuse the crap out of me.
bottle of morphine, that's always good. I'm sorry it's probably so dark for you to see what's going on. But it's not a lot I can really do about it. One gas gas. Oh, that must be for the fucking fuel pump or whatever it is. They must have died right here. Pollock sect member's diary. At first I thought that my brothers did not take off their suits because they still retained hope that we're mitigating the radiation. But now I understand. They know very well what they will find under those rotten ornaments if they took them off. Feated rotten meat hanging from monstrous bodies. I can't take it anymore. This place is a living death. I want to pray before I kill myself. But in the depths of this cursed place, not even God can come with his light down here. It exists only evil. So now we go through this door. Oh, at least it's back out of here. Problem is, I don't know where I've been and where I haven't been. A first aid kit. Gonna have to keep the shotgun out for those guys. I need the um, electric rods for the other ones, I think. Isn't that an iron lung? Yeah. An iron lung they were used during the height of the polio outbreak in 50. Yeah, because there was still somebody, uh, there's still a few people that actually live in these things. I was watching a um, documentary on them uh, a few nights back, actually. Definitely worth a uh, watch as well. It's very interesting. It goes to show the damage that polio had on people. At least we got. Okay. Alright, I know where that is. Okay, well, I'm going to end this episode here, but uh, I hope you're enjoying the series. Uh, looks like we could be getting close to the end, I would have thought now. So, until next time, look after yourselves. Uh, if you're new to the channel, welcome, and I hope you enjoy the new series. But until then, I'll see you later. Bye, everyone.